All right, you guys, this is gonna be a right, left, center, banana hold crunch, okay? So it's not quite a V up, it's a banana that you're gonna be in. So, um, you know, the shape of a banana when we do a banana hold, our upper body and our lower body is up off the ground just like a banana sitting at its little curvature, right? So that's going to be the contracted pose we're going to hold. You will slightly go up and down, um, so there'll be a little bit of rocking, but you'll never fully rest your upper body or lower body on the floor throughout this move. So that's why we're calling it a banana. You're not up in a straight V up. The right, left, and center is we're going to crunch to the right of our body, to the left of our body, and to the center. So there'll be a little bit of oblique twist as I take my hands to the left side of my body, the hands to the right side of my body. That is actually one rep. So if your program is written for a certain amount of reps, right, left, center is rep number one, okay? If it's just written for time, doesn't really matter. When your time's up, you're done. So all of our cues are going to remain the same. We're going to pull in our uh, navel nice and tight. We're going to roll our hips in so we've got our, our core nice and activated. And then we're going to come up into that banana hold. So this is banana hold. It's kind of hard to hold when you're talking, but if this is banana hold, my feet are off the ground, my uh, upper body is off the ground. I'm not pulling with my neck. This would be pulling with my neck. My neck is obviously up, but my shoulders are back, okay? Shoulders are nice and wide, so I'm not pulling with my neck. Now with this, you're going to do right, left, center. See that slight movement with my legs, just rocking back and forth. Right, left, center and continue for time or reps. Enjoy.